Hey everyone, so it's Michelle here with Price Realtors. I wanted to take a minute to go through this home inspection report. I um, had a home inspection with a new inspector yesterday at Pillar to Post, and <clears throat> although I'm not going to show you any of the client's private information, I did want to show you the uh, binder that Brian Norris with Pillar to Post shares with his clients. I was very impressed at the quality of this binder. I mean, it is a really nice binder, nice and heavy. And when you open it up, Pillar to Post actually um, partners with the Salvation Army to um, take any items that you're no longer going to be needing when you're going through the move-in process. And they will, you can schedule and they'll come out and pick up the donations for free. On the inside cover, just notice that it's Brian's business card and then a place for my business card in there. So you'll always have our contact information. As you go into the um, home inspection report, it tells you about the scope of the, the report. You know, it's their code of ex excellence. And then you move on in and this is actually where the inspection report will begin and for my client's protection, I've covered the sensitive information. But in his reports, um, they offer, he offers great pictures where he's circling the items of concern. Um, as you can see there, circling the items of concern. His uh, printer wasn't printing the pictures out that great, but, um, and he continues through the report doing that, showing you potential problem areas. He also, after you get through with your report, you move in and he has a seasons checklist, which is tabbed. And in the seasons checklist, you'll see that um, it's just general maintenance items that uh, every homeowner should be doing in the spring and in the fall and there's a nice little check area for you to go through just to make sure that you're taking care of your home's maintenance which will absolutely extend um, the life of many of these items and when you ever go to resale it will um, help to um, ensure that you're not reducing your property's value by not maintaining these items. So there's um, the season's checklist, and it's on the back side too. And it goes through each of the systems too, interior, electrical, heat and cooling, doors and windows, what you should be doing to these items, your plumbing, foundation, exterior, your roof, and then a place for you to keep notes. There's also, um, it says home systems, it's a home records packet, for you to keep your uh, home records, there's a, there's a little um, pouch here to put them in. There's also a home construction improvements. So it's got the description, your contractor, how much it cost you if there was a warranty, and a date. That's an awesome little feature. There's also the property taxes so that you can track your property taxes that you pay every year. And... Um, that's a good, uh, that, is, that is a good tracking system for you to, to be able to keep all this stuff in one spot. Um, there was one more thing in here. Yes, it's your utilities tracking. This will be very beneficial if you are um, in the future going to sell your home. And very often, uh, I would say every buyer that I have, if they don't ask for it, then I offer to get it anyway. They want to know what the average utilities are for the property, and this is a good way to keep track of that. So, and then in the very back, he offers this great cost guide. So, this cost guide is beneficial because let's say that you want to do some kind of update or, um, you know, just something you're wanting to do in, in reference to your house. So let's say you think, oh, you know what? I think I want to put in a pedestal sink in the bathroom. Well, if you go to the bathroom and you see right there, basin, pedestal type, 
it shows you that the average, this is not an actual, this is just an average, but the average cost to do that is $375. Um, and it just goes on and on. If you want to have your gutters cleaned, the average cost to have gutters cleaned, cleaned is $175. Many buyers have no idea. New homeowners, they don't know. I mean, they've never, they've never done this. Actually, I would even say seasoned homeowners don't know this information. Um, so I thought that is a wonderful tool. Uh, I just wanted to, let me get this in here. I'm working one-handed here. Um, I just wanted to spend a few minutes. I'm getting ready to deliver this home inspection report to the buyer. And I thought that um, it would be great just to show you guys what the home inspection report looks like after it's been completed. If you choose to use Brian Norris with Pillar to Post. It's pretty awesome.